spokesperson of All Nagaland Ad Hoc Teachers Group 2015 batch Bindang Ozukum while speaking to Hornbill TV regarding the ultimatum served by the Department of School Education on the regularization issue of ad hoc employees said that ANATG could not agree with the department's reasons in which it stated that due to a petition filed by the account and PSAN against the government of Nagaland objecting to the appointment of class 1 and 2 gazetted officers without interview, the department was restrained. With the notification given by the Department of School Education to the concerned teachers that the government is constrained to regularize the ad hoc or contract service of the All Nagaland Ad Hoc Teachers Group 2015 batch in view of Supreme Court and High Court standing order, the ANATG also questioned that how, in spite of court restraint order, regularization is happening in other departments when the regularization of ad hoc and contract services reference to P and A R and Cabinet memo has been suspended by the court. ANATG also questioned that on which office memorandum are the other departments regularizing their employees. Catherine, executive member, also said that they will continue their agitation as long as they have positive response from the government. <laughs> Been told about the uh, regularization of ad hoc and contract contract service uh, with reference to PNR and the cabinet memo such and such, which were quashed or you know, which are no more, which has been suspended by the court. But our question here again is, uh, basing on which OM are the other departments regularizing their uh, employees? Then again, even to talk about the uh, Uma Davis case, here we have mentioned uh, some of the regularizations which has happened in the Education Department of Sikkim as well as uh, yes, in the uh, Education Department of Sikkim. And uh, we have also alleged that uh, even though the Uma Devi court case stands and is still in force, other state governments can make arrangement, can sympathize with their state employees and regular, regularize them. So, yes, at this moment, uh, we would also like to, of course, we are going for an agitation, we are going against the government in one or the other way, in one or the other form. But at the same time, we also you know, very politely see that, yes, we do expect some kind of gestures from our state government. Because if other states can regularize their employees in spite of the, despite of the Uma Devi court case, why can't the uh, government of Nagaland do the same for its employees? And uh, we will continue this agitation. As long as we have positive response from the government.